channel. My name is Cara from Norwich. I'm 26 and I do lots of different videos over on this channel. If you're new here, please subscribe down below and leave me a comment. Give me some recommendations for videos. I've been doing loads of hauls recently and I need to rein it back a little bit for my holiday coming up in August. Fingers crossed we get to go. Um, so please leave me recommendations for other videos where I don't have to keep spending money. And yeah, so today is the opposite of saving money. It is a collective haul. I have done a little bit of online shopping in New Look, um, eBay, even though I did put myself on a ban. But now I have completely, I've got rid of the app. So this is before. Um, I've just waited for everything to arrive and some Aldi and Superdrug, but they are tiny. So yeah, if you want to see this collective haul, uh, keep watching. So I'm going to do the Superdrug and Aldi things super quickly first. So when I popped into Superdrug last week, I picked up my trusty Rimmel London Match Perfection con I was gonna say concealer foundation. Um, this is just a regular one that I got used to get all the time and I just noticed in my makeup collection that it wasn't there and I was like I need that just in case um, because at the moment I've been using the Revlon colour stay um, but I got this in 103 True Ivory and I noticed that the Last Imperfection Concealer, getting it out right properly, they've changed the packaging so it used to always be a, bl um, a black lid and it's now gold. I don't know if you can see, there you go. And it says um, up to 16 hour wear. Um, I got it in ivory free and yeah, it was 4.99. So it's actually gone up a little bit as well because it used to be 4.19. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd pick it up and see if it's any different to the other one. I have actually got another one, the old one in my drawer. So I might do um, half and half testing maybe if that's something you'd like to see. And two things that I picked up in Aldi last week. I was doing my food shop, so I'm not going to show you that. But I saw these two Trivial Pursuits. And me and David tried playing it last week. And yeah, the original, I know no answers. So when I saw these, I thought I'd pick them up. So it's Trivial Pursuit Harry Potter. And Trivial Pursuit Friends Edition, which I will take on my weekend away in November hopefully if that all goes to plan um because there's quite a few friends fans there as well so I'd love to take that and just ha ask a few questions um but they were 8 99 each so on to the new look part I think I will do first because I opened it I got it last week and I literally opened it double checked I've got everything and then I put it away you can see I've literally put it back up ready for this video so let's open again and have a look so this is a really small new look order um i only got three items but there was a sale on and i think it was up to 50 percent off and these three things have been in my, in my save for later um basket and i just thought right there's a sale on just grab them ready for my holiday so my three items are another headband so this is a cream faux pearl headband and it was meant to be 6 99 and I got it for £4 and it's a pearl one as you can see and this one from New Look that I got in my last haul was the bridal range one and I absolutely love that one so I was so happy when I saw this and I think I'm going to love this one just as much. And I love pearls, so I'm really happy about that. Just put my one back on. And I picked up these wedges, which I'm I'm unsure about now that I've seen them. I fell in love with them on the online, so I'll only show you one because I don't know if they're going to fit, if I'm going to like them. So these are the wedges that I have picked up. I'm really unsure about them actually. Um, they might look better on, um, but I hope so. So I really wanted a nude pair of high heels to wear when I go out clubbing and I wear my pink and my grey skirts because I think sometimes when I wear a light colour outfit and I've got black shoes, it's just too much. 
So I picked up these and these were meant to be 25 99 and I got them for £18.19. But they are made really nicely. As you can see, like the stitching is all really nice. There's diamonds over where the toes will go. Cork wedge with um, embroidered in a, a plait here. So yeah, we will see, but hopefully they look nice on and in the outfit that I imagine. And the last item that I got in this little new look haul is, it's the top that I wanted and I'm so happy. Um, I wanted to get this in a 14, so it was an oversized look, but they didn't have any. So I just picked up the size 12 and I'm super, super happy about it. So, this is the t-shirt, Stay Wild Forever. And I have literally wanted this for ages. And I kept saying, I didn't need it, didn't need it, didn't need it. I don't need it, but I wanted it, so I got it. So I'm so happy about that. And that was 8 99 I paid full price for that one. So this is my pile of eBay clothes. It looks like more because there's a lot of denim in there. Um, but yes, this is after I put myself on a ban, I actually moved the app and hid it on my phone. But I'm the one who hid it, so I knew where it was and I, yeah, bought these. But now I've deleted the app completely. I've given myself a little ban because I've got a holiday to look forward to. And a holiday I need money to go on, so yes priorities now ready for my holiday but these are the things that I picked up so I'm super happy about this this was actually brand new still had the labels on but I took them all off all this has been washed ready for me to show you and it's a George wrap skirt but look at the colors I'm so excited to wear this I think beer garden summer day out absolutely love it and as you can see it's wrapped and it's got lace at the bottom and i can't remember any of the prices but i'll put them all on the display so you can see but absolutely love that i picked up a pair, two pairs of jeans but this these ones were my favorite these are a light blue wash bit distressed throughout and then distressed right at the bottom and I have two pairs of these already I think I put one in my Primark Best Buys video but they were too big for me so I picked up the size below because obviously Primark is closed at the moment I don't know when I'll be able to go in and I'm desperate for some jeans that fit me so I picked up them I did pick up some others and I thought they were going to be exactly the same as them but in a darker wash but they're not so but they're okay they'll do for work um distressed at the bottom and I was a little bit upset there's distress there but I was a bit gutted when this arrived and it's it's actually quite a big hole so I was a bit gutted about that but that's it's fine eBay it's give and take with eBay. Some things go well, some some wins you don't. So this cami top, which I have honestly worn a hundred times already. And I said in my Primark Best Buys video also that I love these kind of tops. And I just loved that the bottom layer was a different colour. They swapped the colours over and I really liked that one. And I've been wearing that with this denim skirt, which I absolutely love. And like I've said before, I had all these type of skirts in a bigger size, but recently I've gone down to a size 12. So I've had to buy them all again. And without the shops being open, I needed clothes. I wanted clothes. Uh, these are my two favourite items. And I picked up this cream off-white kimono in a size small. But obviously kimonos will do a range. I think it looked nice from 12, 14, 16. And it's this new look kimono. And I just envision wearing this with high-waisted mum shorts and a top on holiday. And I'm so excited. And the last thing, which I have been looking on eBay for quite a few years. Because Primark used to do it and I never picked it up when they did it in the store. And it's this black floral embroidered 
um, pinafore dress, as you can see, which I think is just so super cute. The only thing is, I wasn't sure about the distress at the bottom, but I think it's a little bit too much, so I might have to just trim it back a little bit. Um, but I can't wait to wear that in the autumn winter time. And that's the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching and please stick around for more videos. I've got my first ever Shein haul coming up. I'm just waiting for the parcels to arrive. And my glossy box will obviously be up like usual. And yeah, please go over and follow me on Instagram. So see you guys later.